So if we're looking into divide, if we're looking into finding the least common multiple of these two, it might be a little bit hard if you guys are trying to talk when I'm talking because you're trying to wrap your head around identifying what num what is the same polynomial or number that this divides into and that divides into. And we haven't even talked about dividing polynomials. So just the mere fact of thinking about what they divide into kind of makes my head kind of like turn. It's like kind of crazy. But if I remember my case of 2 times 6, I'm sorry, 2 and 6 and 3 and 4, what I remember is the product of my two factors always gives me a common multiple. It doesn't always give me the least common multiple, but it gives me a common multiple. So I know that x plus 1 times x minus 3 gives me a common multiple, right? And in this case, this actually is going to also be our least common multiple. So when you have numbers, right? You can find the product to find a common multiple, but always look to see if there's a, a smaller one, there's a smaller common multiple. When you're dealing with polynomials, just multiply them to find your least common multiple. Okay, That will always work to find your common multiple. Make sense? No?